Hey guys, welcome back to Eco Boys. This is all being done after the patch on the 23rd of December. So happy holidays to everyone out there. And I haven't played in a while. Not since I did the big bulks of Empire and Realm of Magics because uh, I got very busy Christmas shopping and stuff. But also I had to have a tooth pulled. That was not fun. That was not fun. So I kind of had to take it easy for pretty much a week because uh, getting a tooth pulled is not fun. It's just not fun at all. But uh, I don't have slices of life in my game because uh, it did break with the patch, I think. And I've just not had it in the game because uh, I'm waiting for the update. I think there might be a new update, but I haven't checked yet. But also I have a new mod I added in. And you can kind of see, where is it? There we go. Yes, proudly unique from coming out as insects. Clear off one of my fantastic viewers, directed me to a mod by False Hope called the Intersects mod, which basically adds a reward trait. So your sims now have the intersex uh, identity on them. This sim was born with reproductive or sexual anatomy that doesn't seem to fit the typical definitions of male or female. And it adds like a bunch of uh, like interactions and stuff and it's actually really good it's a, it's good as well because the the person of the mice i spoke to them because i was like thank thank you for making this mod because rep representation all that apparently it's because pimp my sims who does the lgbt mod doesn't have any plans to put intersex into the mod which is a really big shame because there is so little intersex rep out there for the sims community we have the flag in the game which is really nice but there's not very much i was trying to look for like Cass clothing, all the pride clothing, but there was nothing, very little to find, which is a bit of a shame. But we're here back in uh, Eco Boys, and I've got this beautiful mod because even Gabriel is like feeling very trusted, being like, Thank you for telling me this. But there's a fun thing you can do, which is where is it? Express romantic acceptance. And that's like, yeah, that'll give them like really happy moodlets. Baby is asleep. We're going to age baby up today as well. Baby's been a baby for quite a while. And if Kino's looking, if his skin tone is looking a little bit different, when the patch update went through, and I waited for X Mirror Mirror to uh, update the melanin packs, uh, I put them in. I put them back in. And Kino's skin tone changed. He went a few shades lighter and I couldn't find his original tone again. But I managed to find one quite close to it, and I think it's actually looking Logan. pretty good on him. But he went like three shades lighter, and it was very, like, alarming. It was very alarming. You need food. Eat the pancakes. Eat the pancakes that Willow made. Well, technically you started making them, but um, you stopped, and then Willow decided to fin finish it. They got into... Why did you two get into flight moods? Oh, you did. Love conquers all. Love for being different. Kenai is looking forward to the intimate moments with this sim. Because Gabriel loves and cherishes him. How are my kids doing? Okay, you've got homework. And you're doing homework. They're both doing homework. Perfect. We need to make sure they have food after. So this is going to be the final video before Christmas. Because I'm going to be... Well, I've been, t I've been taking a lot of rest. Anyway, but we're gonna, I'm going to be doing this video before uh, before Christmas. It's going to be coming out hopefully later on today. Because it's going to be a busy day for me. And after I come back to this, I'm going back to Realm of Magic. Because we've got the last days with Emrys uh, to deal with. Okay, you guys are being like super, super duper cute, are you? That's because you're both in just really good moods. Kenai, can you be just... Oh god, the plants really need help. Okay, can you harvest everything and weed the plants? Because they're not looking good. They're not looking good. Kids are going to have uh, breakfast or... Oh, it's dinner. It's Saturday night. And you need to... You need to get your practice in the mirror done, Hayden, because you've got... Why does my frame rate die in this world? Uh, I really need a new PC. Santa, please give me a new PC this year. Because I really want one. You need to practice your dramatics. We're going to go and um, 
age baby up as well in a second because baby has been a baby for a while and baby is going to become a toddler rooney don't know why my frame rate was doing fine and then it just dies in evergreen harbor i don't like it it's really bad and willow has still got a few days left don't you you're in like uh what eight days seven days okay seven days to go. Might just have to wait a bit for the frame rate to catch up and then we can get back into the swing of the Yeah, it's quite late, so I'm sending everyone off to bed. In the morning we'll age up Blaze and see just what he's gonna turn out like and I'm just gonna get Tyreen while she's uh still up to do a bunch of her badge stuff because she's done her homework. She's gotta get two more scouting badges to become a unicorn. And check her badge scout progress because she's got scouts tomorrow. So let's get ahead on that. Do the children are too short to interact with the clothesline. Yeah, let's let's put that in the dryer then. It's just getting a little bit of chores done because I can't remember if that'll be one of her badges, but she might have already got that badge actually. But we'll check. But it's raising her responsibility, which is which is the important bit. And then we can check the badges. Any badges you can collect, actually. No. So young scientist, sociability, outdoor adventure, keep fit, good deeds, give badge, give back, and arts and crafts. I thought you went off to sleep. Are you going off to sleep? You're just. Awake, are you too excited to go to sleep? Okay, what have we got to next? Good deeds, sociability, form friendly socials with another sim, take out the trash, help someone with homework, entertain a toddler, make someone laugh. And babies awake. Okay. Uh, Kenai. dad time we're gonna just feed and uh give baby cuddles then i think we might gym up tyreen no you're not supposed to play with the baby that's not what you do that's not your job you are you are a child it's kind of annoying that children interact with the babies when they're crying because i know they just like want to talk to them or something but it's kind of annoying off to sleep. Where are you going? Don't cook food. I told you to go and play with, the, like, sort the baby out. Ah, uh, I think it's because Tyreen wanting to interact with the baby cancelled his action. We need better baby sorting interactions. Technically, the baby has, uh, has until Thursday, but we're gonna age them up today. Let's go, age them up. They came in a bassinet, or at least I put the bassinet in. But I'm wondering if baby's actually going to be... Well, where did everything go then? Stefana sent Blaze a gift. Who's Stefana again? Oh yeah, cousin. So Blaze is aged up. Okay, I love that his toddler cousin has sent him a gift. <gasps> I'm going to do a one, two, three, and then we're going to pick one. A fussy child. Would you be a fussy little child? Wild, probably. Or a charmer. We had a charmer and an angelic, because that's what Tyreen and Hayden were. Wilds are always good because they get energy, because they always get their movement up really fast. Can do it. Inquisitive or independent. Independent is much easier because they they do things all by themselves. Or clingy. Ooh, it's... I feel like we need more of these toddler traits. Okay, I don't know what's going on with my camera, but it's been very weird right now. Okay, the kid has some interesting CC, so we're gonna... We're going to cast full edit and 
sort him out a little bit. First question is, yep, magic is strong in this family, but also rainbow t-shirt. That's adorable. All right. Come on, Blaze. Let's go and modify you in casts. The magic genes in this family are strong. Like, super strong. So far, I think Tyreen and Hayden are the only ones who aren't magic, and that's because they were made in test tubes. Okay, we've got a lot to work with here. We might have to figure out what the... Oh, what your skin tone is meant to be, because this is a lot to work with. Are you wearing a hairline and short hair? Okay, I don't know what those eyes are. You meant to have green eyes. Yeah, you need beautiful little green eyes. Kid's looking alright. We'll go and change the hair quickly. And then we'll add all the details. Quickly add... Yes, because you got the praline buzz cut on. But I think I got some new hairs. Maybe. Yes, this is new hair. It's from a... It's um, a new hair from... From Anto. It's the Charlie hair. It's early access right now because I pledge. I pledge to Anto because I love their hair. So it's actually quite cute. I think you could put a little hat on. Then could you put the little hat on them as a toddler bean? You can. Oh, that's adorable. That's adorable. All right, let's put make a little red hat. That's kind of adorable. Kind of. Oh, I don't know about the the hair now. Okay, I'm always gonna be sewing through it. Let's go and do all the skin details. Skin tone is quite light. But you can't see it selected on here because it's, um, what was that tone? Oh, that might be Key Nice new skin tone. That might be why. Yes, because I made it custom because I, uh, I, uh, why can't I get words out right now? I had to make sure I saved as a custom skin tone so I could remember what one it was. That's what I'm trying to say. But yeah, Blaze is a lot lighter in tone than uh, his two siblings. I think the game does take into genetics. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Blaze is all done. He's looking super adorable. I give him a little uh, doty, but they count as glasses, so I can't. But he's actually super duper adorable. He's super adorable. I'm banking on him looking a bit more like Kenai when he gets Oh, I'm gonna go grab some cute little little pictures of him because he's just so adorable. He's meant to have brown hair, but I like this hair, but the hair's just terrible. They don't have any good recolors. Like for toddlers, which is a shame. Okay. <laughs> he just yeeted the child all the way over there, but now I can go and sort out the bedroom, which has a quite big windows. Because currently we've got this little corner which can stay. We'll get rid of um, Spellcaster Bassinet and we'll go and put in a little bed. It might just be we're putting in a bed. Okay, did not mean to pick those up. We also do need to put in a potty, so. Oh, we'll put the potty over here. Let's move um, Mr. Let's move Mr. Teddy over here and we'll put the bed in the corner. Ah, uh, toddler bed. What should we have? That's a good toddler bed. This one. The eco loves that one because it's cute. I'll put this here. Because then Blaze can put it in his inventory. Ooh, but what colour scheme though? That's super cute. There we go, nice. <laughs> nice and easy. That's so cute. Alright, you get to do lots of little cuddles with blaze was it snuggle do a little snuggle a little snuggle with baby because he's just so cute he's just so cute and Kino's like I love you so much my little my little miracle but uh do you have anything to do okay oh you want to go play dollhouse oh I'd love to play with the dollhouse but you have to go off to sleepy bice We'll send baby off to sleepy buys. Oh, and you can go and put a breakfast on. 
or actually clean out the spoiled food and then we're going to go and cook breakfast for everyone quite the movement skill baby blaze blaze ember shub your name is fire fire pointy thing uh let's do uh egg and toast party size because this is a big family now I just realized I'd given Blaze two names with fire. Hey, why are you up? I thought I told you to go to bed. Stop wanting to talk to your daddy. Go to bed. I'm going to get Tyreen up so she can come downstairs. And she can have a chat with dad. I have some ideas for Tyreen already. I say already. Like, she's only just became a child. But I have some ideas for when she's a teenager. Because currently she's a geek with a strong bloodline and top-notch toddler. So she's doing pretty well for herself. And her responsibility is on the rise, along with conflict resolution. But I do want her to get all the scout badges like Gabriel did. And I'd love for her to be a collector as well. And do like a bunch of like collect a bunch of cool things because like we got the we got the posters one which is pretty cool and we got all the the easter eggs so i kind of have this idea for her maybe when she's a teenager that she'll meet like she'll get like this little friendship group maybe she'll split off from hayden just for a little bit but these two are going to move out to del sol with um troy when they're young adults because i have like ideas for that and I think it would be fun for them to get like a cool little spin-off. Also, you can get your friendly social badge if you uh, chat with... Chat with um, Papa, ask for a sibling. Do it and see what uh, Kenai's reaction is. Because if he says yes, then... Perhaps we could think about giving them another baby later down the line. What is it you guys have? You got like you got a long time till you're a uh, um adults, and they've got three kids already. They did wait a little bit. They had some time because they wanted to build the house first. Nope, that's your uh, I think sixty three days. Like Asriel and Castiel pretty much getting up there, but they've got like. Castiel's got a teenage son already who's going to become immortal when he hits 18 so that's going to be fun for him Basil's got a little girl and Asriel's dealing with a little a little toddler but I'm curious to see what uh, what's, what's his answer going to be what's his answer going to be is he going to is he going to say yes I'll get you a uh, a, a sibling <laughs> or is it gonna be uh no you've got two siblings already unless Tyreen's asking for a sister because she might want a sister Kenai's child wants a sibling but he doesn't want another baby right now so yeah Kenai's like look there's a lot of new things in my life right now and we've just had your little brother maybe not right now not right now, we're not having another kid. We've already got three in the house. And it's a rainy Sunday. Which is not fun at all. And yeah, baby doesn't like... Baby doesn't like thunderstorms. So everyone's now in like pretty tense moods. Except for the kids in Kenai. They're all in pretty good moods. Ooh, I need you to do something. You need to get your fabrication skill up to level 10, so forget playing video games and setting things on fire. I need you to do a freelancing gig. Anyone will do. Okay, looks like you need to go sleep then. Oh, everyone is just... The thunderstorms just make everyone super tense. And Hayden's in a pretty pissed off mood. Anyway, why are you in a pissed off mood anyway? I think it was because Grandma yelled at him, maybe. Maybe mess around on the vanity. Just for a little bit. And 
and then Willow has to just clean everything up because it's... She's... I always forget she's a slob, so... Everything... She's always a bit messy. And you drew a fun little rainbow. Cool. I'm just getting Tyrene to do the art stuff on the craft table to get her next badge. The vehicle next. It's just drawing all the crafts and stuff. But gets the badges. At least and Gabriel's doing a nice bit parenting. And then yeah, time for sleepy bice because very tired. Very tired that it's making you angry. That did not go well. Scout meeting in an hour. Makeup did not playing with the makeup did not go well for you, did it? I'm sure they get better at it. I pr I think they might. I think they're meant to get better at it, maybe if you make them do it several yes. times. Because currently he's just his face is just purple. Purple on the nose and the cheeks and bright red. I mean I think the eye the eyeshadow's not looking too bad, but everything else needs a bit of work. Uh -huh. I think your problem is you're just caking your face uh -huh. with it. Also, why are the eyeliner pencils like huge? The eyeliner pencils are like ridiculously huge for some reason. And Tyreen's got scouts coming up, so when she's done with that, she's going to be off to scouts. Uh, she's got to get one more badge. Hopefully she'll be able to get it. And I'm hoping with enough practice, the makeup like gets better. Glamorous. Hayden added a few layers of makeup just to be sure he even got it m right. In most of the right spots. So you do it enough times that I think they get better at it, but Hayden's looking. Add that, the, okay, that's a little bit too much. Hayden, it needs to be subtle. It needs to be subtle. I'm sure it looks much better in harsh lighting when you're going to be on a stage. But for now, in regular lighting, it's looking a bit too, it's looking a bit too much. I wish there was an option to clean it off, though. But... At least it worked. He'll probably look much better when he's practicing as a teenager. And you've got scouts in a bit. You drew... What's that? Vehicles? Oh, you drew like a couple cars. Front facing. That's pretty smart. Off to scout meeting. Sweet. Oh, you should have been there at 2 o'clock. Okay. Oh. You got sentiment with uh, with baby probably from tucking tucking him in. That's so cute. Okay, foodies then. Foodies then. Gabriel or Blaze rather. I'm getting all my names mixed up. Blaze is just su Blaze is actually super adorable. I'm very. I hope he's gonna look even more adorable when he gets uh older because I gave him nice big eyelashes as well. I think he's gonna be super cute. Hayden's looking it, it's a look Hayden. It's a look. You might have to work on it just a little bit but I think you're getting there. If I do that does it get rid of it? It does yeah. Immediately getting rid of the mood look gets rid of it. Did you get sent to it with someone? Did she hurt you? Did she? Oh! Hayden feels wronged by Willow. Willow, did you did you snap at your grandson? That's 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 unfortunate. And is the oh it's Nita. It's Nita being just like, hey mum, checking in. Checking in, Ghost of Yona's still hanging around. As well. There we go. Kids. One kid two kids are off to sleep, one's at scouts. One dad is sleeping, Willow is watching TV, inspired by the cooking channel, and Gabriel is just just fixing on things. Oh. I want to check something, because I noticed this happened every time I put them down in a save. 
Okay, just very attractive. For some reason, I put them down to get pictures in an, in like uh, the photo safe, essentially. Ah. And Willow thought Gabriel was like the most handsomest thing she'd ever seen. Ah. It was quite funny to see, but also that's your son-in-law, Willow. Please, please, please. It was bad enough for one time I was doing something in my game and then Willow called up Astral to be like, I think I love you, Astral. And it's like, Willow, no, that's your, that's your son-in-law. All right, I'm actually going to have Gabriel ah. just clean everything up because it's plates everywhere. Then you get to do some Vigia games. You're not so much a freelance crafter anymore, are you? You really should be. Because your fabrication skill still needs some work. Closer from happy memories. Oh, got a cute little sentiment with Blaze. You don't have a lot of friends, do you? You're still good friends with... Knox, but you guys don't have many friends anymore. I think you completely lost um your connection with Raylan, which is a shame. Raylan, who got married and had lots of kids, apparently. Tyrion is back for scouts. Yes. Oh God, it's boiling hot. Oh, you soaked. You are, I think. Yeah, damp clothing. Damp clothing. Oh, did the laundry not uh, pan out? All right. I'm thinking sleepy buys and calling it here for Eco Boys. We have Baby Blaze is now a toddler, and he's looking super super adorable. So I'm gonna make sure I save this version of the Eco Boys to the gallery, or at least to my library. I like to keep like track of them when things change and stuff, which is cute. Hayden's makeup skills are getting there. They're getting there. I think. If I put Slice of Life back in, he might be able to start learning the makeup paintings. And uh, the painting skill by putting makeup on. I can't remember. I think it only applies to teens and up. But he'll be getting there. And Kina and Gabriel. No more babies for a while. No more babies for a while. But they seem to be doing... Alright, the rain has stopped. What is that? Moments peace from tucking in a toddler. Okay. But I now have the intersex mod for Kenai and it's really working out. Especially because of all the fun positive things. Kenai can also like talk about uh what was that uh, there was like two other friendly interactions like, that were quite interesting. She can come out express anger about unnecessary surgery. And there was also one of promote end intersex surgery campaign. For you know a lot of it is like invasive procedures and it's it's not good it's not good and I think also on a computer he can chat to people as well it's a it's a really good mod I highly recommend you download it I'll put it in the description because I think it's actually like a really good mod to have in socialized yes in sex chat room yes I think that's really cool because it's um I think it's just good rep. It's just good rep. Especially for Kino. So I'm really glad this mod exists. I will link it for you guys. Donald, no, we're not making a donation to charity. As mean as that sounds. Hey, look, Raylan is actually walking by. How is Raylan doing? By the way. Oh, yeah, she's a Feng. She married one of the Fengs. But she's also fabulous. And I think she doesn't have... Yeah, she doesn't have... Um, CCI is just regular ones. Alright, I'm going to finish this episode up here. I hope you guys enjoy the holiday season. And when I get back, we're going back to Roma Magic. Emma's last days are coming up. And Serena and Corvo are going to be doing some fun stuff together. They're going to be hanging out a lot more. So it's going to be fun. Thanks, guys. I'll see you all then. Bye-bye now. It wasn't always right